welcome to Tilda Vision Ideas. Tilda Vision Ideas is a program that explores ideas and concepts in the following areas. Psychology, parapsychology, consciousness, ESP, dreams, spirituality, healing, creativity, quantum physics, business wealth, and the Word of God. As you know, we're very creative, and we got so creative, everybody was running around at the very last second, <laughs> because we, we timed things to the second, because we were so busy talking about everything but <laughs> the sound. So I'm so happy that you have tuned into uh, today's program. And the name of today's program is called, what is it called? Jewelry by Jamie. Mm -hmm. And why did we call it Jewelry by Jamie? Because Jamie's sitting right here, right next to me. And why her jewelry? Because she made it. It's all handmade. When, when I was speaking with Jamie, I said, well, you know, bring a few pieces. And she's saying, like, how many? I said, well, you know, as many as you think. Well, she walks in with boxes and boxes and bo and each one is unique. Each one is one of her inspirations. And uh, we will begin showing you some of them simply because um, it's just too many. <laughs> know that they're handmade, that they're semi-precious stones. Some of them have Swarovski crystals. Others, you, Jamie will let you know. And so... Jamie, thank you for being on the show once again. You're welcome. And you know that Jamie's show last time was on healing Reiki because she's a Reiki master. And so uh, one of her gifts is doing healing work. And she completes the healing work creating jewelry. And she also names, <laughs> she names her jewelry. So with no further ado, so we have a piece here that Jamie will hold up for you to see. And that looks a bit G Egyptian, which is, um, I'm waiting for Joey to put it on the screen. So there, uh-huh, and so it's facing that camera. And oh, there it goes, that looks beautiful. And it has a, an Egyptian look. It's very Egyptian. I believe that the colors are very Egyptian. They use very brilliant colors, I guess, back in the day <laughs> in uh -huh. Egyptian time. And turquoise and greens, corals, lapis, and gold. And I've tried to recreate that look in this piece of jewelry. Okay. Um, I have an affinity for um, Egyptian. Okay. And I like it very, very, very much. And we d we're not accepting calls this time because we're very busy over here. Uh, <laughs> Trying to. Yeah. yeah. This is a natural piece. This is. These are beads, uh, which sterling silver. And um, as you can see, this is lava beads. They're all from the earth. It's a very um, energizing piece. Um, I, I'm assuming these are the larger ones are the lava, right? The large black stones Stone. are the lava rock uh -huh. and um, obsidian. Obsidian. And there may be some, and there's smaller lava rocks inside the silver pieces here. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. This is a very grounding piece. Uh, it's of the earth, and um, I like it a lot. Beautiful. Um, so simply beautiful. E piece. Each one is so beautiful that I would not be able to, with the right um, outfit. outfit <laughs> um, look at this, how gorgeous that looks. I don't looks. remember the name of this stone. It's a natural stone. It has like a mustard colored running through it and um, amethyst. Uh, and then there's purple roses with some Swarovski crystals also nice. on it. Very nice. It depends on what you wear. Um, I also charge, because I am a Reiki master, I charge my um, house and anything that comes near me or whatever I make uh, with Reiki energy. Okay. So they're charged with that. This is made with crystals and look how stunning that looks. I don't remember the, the names black. of all these stones, uh, but it's very pretty. It has Swarovski crystals. There's pearls, and then on the top here are um, it could be a jasper stone. That's what it is, jasper. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a very pretty piece. And Gorge it, gorgeous. And it sparkles, too. So. It does. It does. Very beautiful. Mm -hmm. We have this bracelet that I'm holding. I don't know why. Matilda likes this bracelet. Yeah. There was something um, about it. It's a little lower. Mm -hmm. It's also um, very Egyptian looking. Um, it's got different color stones. It's got crystals in it and uh, gold stones, gold gold plated stones and a magnetic clasp and it looks great on. Oh yes, and about the clasps, it, it's so they're easy. Magnets. They're magnets, so they're very easy to put on, especially when you, when. And this one. Oh, um, so attractive, look at that, against the black. Yeah. 
So oh, go gorgeous. It, it does pop. That and one pops, yes. I, I think there's hematite beads in this and uh -huh. crystals. Oh my god, look how gorgeous it looks so, on the screen. Yeah, it does. Trick or treat. Nice. A nice so. Halloween piece. <laughs> <laughs> Huh. You know, and each one is so unique and so different and so beautiful. S most of them take a few hours to make. Uh, this one took many hours because each one of these blue beads here are handmade. Uh, and they're ended with a Swarovski crystal, plus these are gray pearls. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's of the sea. Um, it's a very healing piece. It's a soothing color to look at. Um, people love the color blue. I th I'm s I there we go. Just drop it. Well, I don't want to crack. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. This is of the sea. It reminds me of the sea. Again, it's like a, um, jasper pieces and uh, glass. There we go. And glass pieces there. I got it. I scented it. <laughs> and it, it's very pretty on. I think, yes. I, I have it backwards? No, no, that's right. No, you had it right. Um, this took hours to make. It's all crystals, and um, uh, reminiscent of the rosary. Yes, Joey th told us it looked like the rosary. You could, I, I don't think there's enough beads on it to go around the rosary, uh, but uh, it's kind of <laughs> hard to center this. But um, this one goes that way, and this one goes that way. It's a very pretty piece. It sparkles and it's unique. These are all one-of-a-kind pieces. I don't make them twice the same, only because I want everybody to have, when they buy my jewelry, uh, to have an individual piece. This is now all amethyst stones, uh, the stones on the top, thank you. And um, all of them, this is amethyst, and it, it just looks great in the summertime with the tan. It's, mm -hmm. And it's a very smooth stone. There's pearls in here, and it's just very, very smooth to wear on your skin. When you have natural gemstones, they're very soothing to the skin. Now, these are a bunch of different gemstones. I couldn't tell you all the names of them. Uh, there's a lot of pieces of different kinds of jasper, and it reminds me of the chakra system, so I like this piece a lot. And it's, um, it's pleasing to the eye. Now, the next one is like a party piece. My daughter likes this one. Um, <clears throat> these are all Swarovski crystals. And I believe these little tiny beads in here are turquoise. So um, this is a very pretty piece on. Sparkles a lot. It does sparkle a lot. You can, the, when the light hits it, it, it's beautiful. Now this is my favorite piece that's coming up next. And it took me hours and hours and I'm hours <laughs> to do. <laughs> Let me put it the right way. Okay. I'm sorry. It t this took hours to do. And as you see, it, it's very Egyptian. Let's see. Let's put it this way. It's very, very Egyptian. If you could hold that up. There's a matching bracelet that goes with it, which is beautiful also. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. then there's the earrings that go with it. How um, gorgeous. You know, you all dressed up. It looks very pretty. Gorgeous. It's one of my favorite pieces. Um, now, <laughs> the orange one. This made everybody laugh before, but it's because called the portal. That's so that right. we could, when you wear it, you can go into another dimension. So we keep it very spiritual. <laughs> no. But I don't know if you could see that, but it's, it's, it's big. <laughs> but it looks great on. So it makes people smile, too. Yes. <laughs> it's simply beautiful. And then we have something and This is of the ocean. Yes. And this is made with uh, crystals and copper. Which is a very, very good thing to put on your body. Copper has healing. healing energy. Uh, it's very good if you have arthritis. Um, it charges your body also. So, so does silver. Uh, I use silver and gold. So, Jamie, let's stop here for a second and, and you tell me when you're making a piece, so what do you think or do you think at all? Or, or things just come to you? The, uh, go ahead. They, they, they normally just come to me, but I have to see my beads and then sometimes I don't like it and I'll tear it out and I have to make sure that they're all connected to each other and I just put the piece together. So, so, so you spread out the beads, is that the idea? I, I can do that. Um, I work in a very tiny space so I don't really have it all over the place. Mm -hmm. I'll just 
know the beads that I'm going to use beforehand, and then I go and I create the piece. Mm -hmm. I'll pick the beads out first, though. Like, I'll go and buy the beads, and I'll have it in my mind. Well, this is what I'm going to do. Okay. And an example, a good example of that <laughs> is this piece here, because I picked the most unusual beads that people would never pick. This is a lariat, and it could it's beautiful. Um, it's a very long piece, by the way. It's very long. It's 44 inches long, and you could wear it in many different ways. Um, this is the tassel part of it. Um, let go of that. And you'll see in a second if I can just adjust it like this. This is the tassel, and it yes. hangs down. And as you can see, there's lots of chain to it. That's the whole piece. And you could wrap it like a choker around your neck. Matilda? They can see you. Like, like I tried to put it on. You could wrap it like this and slip it through like a knot uh -huh. on this side and wear it short. Or you could also wear it very, very long. long. Okay. You know, and you could wrap it also around your neck. Watch the mic. Okay. Wonderful. I have a smaller piece here. Uh huh. This is one of my favorite pieces because I'm dainty uh, with my jewelry choice. Very simple. And I like this a lot for evening wear. It's all with crystals, and it was very difficult to make. It was not an easy piece to make. What made it difficult? The beading pattern itself oh. and intertwining it and making it look like a chain. This is all crystals sewn in to make it look like a chain. Wonderful. There are earrings and a ring to match that. Of, oh, yes. By the way, uh, her pieces, Jamie's pieces, have sometimes the bracelet and most definitely the earrings to match, right. which is a beautiful um, makes for a beautiful set. Right. You have some over there that we haven't shown. I believe I showed um, these. There's so many. Yeah, there um, are just so many. Um, what about the ones right up here? No? Uh, the only two that we didn't show are this, is this okay. one. This one's very bright. This is a shell also. And um, I'll, I'll hold the board. Uh -huh. Very interesting centerpiece. Yeah, and it's it's longer as you can see as I drop it because it's you know just a longer piece. Mm -hmm. It's very pretty on. Mm -hmm. This is a shorter choker piece. This is 24 karat uh, beads, which are very very expensive. So the piece itself it's very tiny, but it was very costly to make mm -hmm. um, because of the kind of beads that were put in into this. Mm -hmm. They twist when they're in their package, but it has a crystal bead on it. It's very hard to see. It's darker tones and um, has a very a pretty filigree um, very clasp it's on stunning, it. Stunning, stunning, gorgeous. So, um, yeah, and then, you know, I go casual, too. I go eclectic. I used to, I started off making jewelry just with vintage beads. I would search flea markets and go to tag sales and look for old, old jewelry and take it apart and then recreate. And that's how I started selling my jewelry, by using vintage beads. So um, a lot of these beads that I have over here, these are all vintage beads. Okay, but those are too small. Okay, no, I wanted show. to get the... Um, the necklace? Yeah, this thing. Oh, the because vintage. Yeah. This is a vintage cloisonne. And if you look for it, these are... There's earrings and also the piece to go with it. And you could switch them off because they have different sets. And you just put them on a um, wire. And this is the necklace. And this is the earring Watch your hands. that looks just like the necklace. I don't know if you could see them up here. Put it over like this. Um, Can you zoom in on, on that one, Joey? Z zoom in. Uh huh. OK, I think we can get. Cloisonne has a, a very distinct look. Can you explain a tiny bit about uh, the cloisonne? Cloisonne is enameled artwork. And so it's etched on a piece of metal, and then it's enameled on top of it. And they're um, very unique pieces. These have also uh, jasper stones in them, um, which I like. And those are the earrings uh, mm -hmm. over here. Mm -hmm. And um, this is just the, the necklace. It's a choker, and it just dangles on your neck. Mm -hmm. um, very pretty. And it's interchangeable very with clean a bunch looking. of them. Yes. Very clean mm -hmm. sleek. Yes. But very. different. So very. I like my jewelry to be different. I don't like it to be anything like it's and in each the piece, store. Each piece is uh, different. There's very not different. I don't think I've seen you repeat no. anything. No. There, there's the no design repeat. itself. So like, Jamie's extremely creative. Like She also cooks. 
<laughs> extremely creative in the kitchen. This and is I, a, another pair of earrings. So I always leave a message, call me whenever you're not cooking. <laughs> and she does. <laughs> But these are kind of fun. These are made out of actually clay, so it's all natural material. Mm -hmm. Some coral beads are on, on, on this oh, one. Oh, and by the way, here, let's keep, keep, keep that. I'm wearing, I'm wearing this, um, where is it? You have to come where am I? Okay, there it goes. I'm wearing that bracelet, and I have another one. <laughs> I have all these bracelets. Where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Oh, there, there it you goes. Are. That's just a, a simple, plain very, bracelet, but uh -huh. it's very colorful and very, and uh -huh. very you know, playful. Right. Did we do those? We did all of these. We, we did. That was yes. fast. We Any did. other necklaces? Oh. There's tons of them here. Okay. So, um, well, Jamie looks. I mean, we have so much to show that it's not. E oh, look at this! It's stunning. I'll hold it. <laughs> I'll hold it while we we want to show as much as we can. Okay. I think right here is there it, there it is. Perfect. It's very pretty. This that's all turquoise and, and pearls. Nice. And I think aqua this is aquamarine. Marine, yes. These little beads are turquoise and these are the pearls. Mm -hmm. And then here's another one that's fun. This is turquoise also. Oh that's beautiful. I love the combination of the pink and the turquoise. Thank you. Yes. Oh look at that combination. That reminds me of the one you just showed a little while ago. Yeah. Yes. Th no, this is a, it's like an orange and a salmon and um, teal and turquoise. Mm, pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay. And then here's my favorite color is purple, so I tend to go towards purple. I think I made this for myself. <laughs> <laughs> but um, it's Has kind it of ever fun. happened that you make something and you, you, you don't want to let it, it go? Yeah. No, no, no. You, you let people, it go? Yeah, they'll buy it right off my neck. <laughs> <laughs> so. This is kind of fun. It's kind of hard to see on TV right. because it's such dark purple, but they're very pretty purple iridescent you beads. Screen. Oh, you can. Okay, so it, okay. It, it's a very simple piece, but uh, I like it. It says a lot. <laughs> okay, so um, these are kind of interesting. These are glass, and they're little balls that hang, and it's, it's very colorful on your neck, um, and it's kind of different. Again, all my pieces are one of a kind. So they're all individual, and I don't think you would ever see a necklace like this in the store no. because of the uniqueness of it and the, the kind of beads that I use. So I experiment with beads that nobody would normally uh, experiment with, and I put them uh, into use. This is like earthy also. It's copper and, and uh, the metal beads, and um, it's a bracelet, and it's fun. This is my purple one. Oh, this is pretty. Stunning, stunning. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful it looks on the screen. Oh. And Matilda's wearing this one around her neck. Oh, and yes, earrings. I to, yeah. I don't trying <laughs> to match her shirt tonight. <laughs> I so. don't know if you can see it. It's very colorful. And um, I don't know if Joey's attempting to get, but there it is. I, I don't know if you could see it. But it's, oh, there he goes. There he goes. So they're pretty. Oh, look at it. And we chose this one simply because we thought it would blend with the blouse. Right, and it uh, does. Uh-huh, and so, and then I have some earrings, I think. Yeah, I do. Look at the earrings. Mm -hmm. mm, pretty, pretty. Green again. Uh -huh. Green and rose color. No, nice. I'm going to take them off before I forget mm. <laughs> and go home with your earrings. Mm. <laughs> nice. So, Jamie. When you go shopping, you must go crazy selecting. Um, I yes. invited, a, th this was interesting. I, I used to go to a beach shop. Uh, it's, um, <clears throat> they sell wholesale and, of course, retail out in Patchogue. And I said, oh, Jamie, I got information. <laughs> and Jamie says to me, Maddie, I have so many beads. Now I understand you don't need to buy anymore. Uh, when I went in inside that store, there were beads on the walls, on the tables, all over. Mm -hmm. It was, um, uh, I felt. W a bead is heaven. I mean, it's like an emporium when you go in it, into a it bead store. And you have to know the kind of beads. Because that you want and you need. And each bead has a price. A price, yes. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, some are very costly. Some, yes. you know. Uh, like you just mentioned the glass bead or the Swarovski crystal Those or the other stones. Yes. yes. 
When I have Swarovski in my pieces, they're expensive. Because oh, yes. the bead themselves are expensive. Yeah, I see it right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is kind of a fun piece, too. Yes, okay. Um, well, we didn't show this one? No. And it's very colorful. Oh, it's very pretty. And oh, yes, very Look at this. And it just looks good on your neck. Nice. Nice. There. And it matches your logo. Oh, it does. Look at that, the universe. Yeah. The purples, the blues. Yeah, it does. Isn't it interesting? It, it, it's, yeah. Very interesting. Let's mm -hmm. put it closer to the logo. Let's see what, oh, yeah. wow. Look at that. Look at that. You'll have to hang it around its neck. <laughs> 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 so ideas come to me when I'm sleeping also. Like, I'll be sleeping. I go, oh, that would be great. That would make a great necklace. Oh, you found that one. <laughs> this oh, is pretty, know. too. This is gray pearls and he hematite. Oh, how stunning. Look how beautiful it looks. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! It, and it does. It sh it glistens. Yes, it glistens. You see, sometimes you don't get to appreciate it fully when they're together with th with the rest of them. Right. Mm -hmm. I, I make dainty pieces too. Sometimes I mean they're very dainty. But this is a dainty piece. This is all sterling silver with uh, crystals, Swarovski crystals, and uh, yes, yeah. Uh, you really can't see the beauty of this one, but it's like diamonds hanging on your neck because mm. it, it shines. It's pretty. And these are all hand-stamped silver pieces. Uh -huh. these, uh, these I just need to know the time. Is it time for me to reintroduce the show? Not yet. Okay. Okay. Mm. Did we do this one? Oh, that's a turquoise one. Um, here's one that we haven't done. Oh, uh, look at this color. This is all uh, crystals and pearls. Semi precious with silver. It is nice. And it, it, it just, it, it's beautiful on. See how that? Yes. It's a shame that, w you know, we, we wanted to show s as many as we could, so we're not even holding them the right way. Oh, the stunning. Yeah, that's a pretty one. Wow. It's a very fallish colors. Yes, and, uh, yes. Very brilliant. bright. Pretty, 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 pretty. These are made with wooden, wooden, um, I have a price tag on that. Um, these are made with wooden beads that were vintage, uh, with gold uh, filled beads and a uh, very earthy piece. Um, it has matching earrings too. It looks very, very pretty on a, on a black sweater. Mm -hmm. you know, just different kind of look. Amber? Um, it looks like amber, but they're actually glass pieces, and they're all vintage yeah. glass. So the color is very unusual. Also, it's um, you don't see this color too often anymore, because the older the bead, they don't recreate the new beads with the same uh, colors as they were a long time ago. And I like the colors of the the older beads more so than the newer beads. These are a pair of earrings that I just happened to pick. These are abalone the with a crystal. Mm -hmm. And that's a very, it, it picks up all the color in the shell. And I think these are very pretty. Um, they're different beads. And all my earrings are very, very lightweight, so they will not bother your ear. This is Mother of Pearl. And um, Oh, it's transparent. Yes, it's transparent. It's like a tortoise shell, but it's not tortoise because I would never use that. Uh, but they're very, very pretty. Nice. They, Very nice. Mm -hmm. They look really pretty on your ear. Gold filled pieces. Translucent. Translucent. Yes, they are. These are uh, pink quartz, which are very healing for your heart chakra, by the way. They're bohemian, some of the style. Look at this. Yeah. Those are very Indian ish, like from Bali or India. Um, this is a natural stone amazite, I think it's called. Amazite. Okay. If we can get it down there. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. Oh my goodness, that's my space earrings. And space. <laughs> yeah. Now these are funny because these are actually from the 50s. Or a certain era are called Ems, Eames era. Atomic era. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, but I, they make me laugh. And they make me happy, and I've s I've sold few of them. Which way? This way. Okay. <laughs> there we go. We go. <laughs> <laughs> but they actually, they're if you if you're a very creative person, you'll love to wear my jewelry. And it, it's very artsy and <laughs> and kind of different. <laughs> we, we need the right makeup. <laughs> yes, exactly. 
<laughs> okay. And we showed out all of these? Like those. I was looking for the bracelet then. Okay, the bracelets. I, I found one. <laughs> don't go off the screen. No, I don't know where the bracelet bin is. I was in the bag, probably. We showed that bracelet. I, I know. Well, while you were looking for something, I decided Well, can to I bend over and get the other bag? Can I help you? Uh, I guess this one over here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Joey. So we'll talk while Joey gets the things. <laughs> Joey is very flexible. Thank you, Joey. Joey's on the floor getting us the bids. <laughs> Because we have bins and bins. No, because you also have three cameras on you. <laughs> <laughs> Two are on. Okay. That's why it went in there. Mm -hmm. right. oh, look at all these bracelets. I'll just pick one while you're looking for the one that you li like or you, you have in mind. So this, this looks like a choker instead of a bracelet. Oh, because no, they're I see. Magnets. Uh, they're I like magnets. I use and magnetic they're class because they're very easy for one to get on. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> and so they all stick together in the um, case that I have them in. Okay, so look at, we have so many to show that I think, are you? They stick together. Yes. Th this is a double magnet. <laughs> but you can see the different patterns and yes. the different kind of beads that I use. Yes, yes. Um, this is, um, I forget, this is a milk glass bead, actually, with Swarovski crystals. These are goldish beads with just beads, those are. Mm -hmm. But, um... I was trying to see. The middle one matches your blouse. Really? Okay. <laughs> the yes, it does. It does? Okay. Um, I'm on this side because the camera is on that This is, side. again, another piece oh, that oh, looks pretty. kind of Egyptian to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's just all different kinds that I make. So, you know, I have fun with color. I like color. And uh, whatever hits my mind. And when you're beading, are there other people near you beading? No, I bead by myself okay. and with my music on in the background. Oh, okay. What kind of music? Um, usually classical. Okay. You know what they say about classical music, right? That it, um, it impacts a certain part of the brain. That, the that, the yes, creative part. The creative part, yes. And so they suggest that even when we're pregnant, we should listen to uh, classical music. Mm -hmm. and, and my baby's... I don't yes. like it because I did. Oh, you did? <laughs> My kids. And supposedly, it, when the children are exposed to that, it, ma it, ma it calms them. Mm -hmm. And also, it, um, they become creative just by listening to music. Can you imagine? Yes. Yes. This one's kind of interesting. I mm -hmm. found these really weird beads, so the bracelet is kind of weird. <laughs> nice. It's uh -huh. got it uh, interesting, right? Mm -hmm. and it goes on. Halfway mark. Halfway mark. Okay. So I...